Howdy folks, it's Edge of Jesus here. Some people do not deserve what they have. Some people even don't deserve their sexual organs. And some never get the chance to use them. Like me. Anyway, here's some fucking oddballs that got caught in 128k Ultra HD, HDR, and got their shit printed out on wanted posters for being so goddamn strange. Here's the first one. So this lady posted a TikTok, and one of the comments she got was, I'd pick cotton for you. Bro, for those of you who aren't Americans or are in the second grade, the context behind this shit is that the whites enslaved the blacks and the spicks, but they mainly killed the spicks, and made them pick cotton instead of doing something cool like building tourist attractions or pyramids. So basically, this motherfucker said that he'd be willing to be enslaved and endure all the torture for a little bit of pussy. Dog, you cannot be saying this shit. If any of the 51% of my audience is watching this, please find this man and get him some pussy. Or at least so someone please start a GoFundMe for this man so we can at least get a flashlight. Because this isn't even down bad anymore. This is down cataclysmic. Next tweet. Fuck it. If she got crabs, where's the butter? If any of you ladies got crabs, please hit me up. 51% of my audience, please do not approach this man. He should be considered a terrorist for this shit. I don't understand the thought process behind people who tweet these things. Because who wants their mustache to itch like hell? Like, getting razor bumps is already bad enough, but imagine this stupid fuck getting razor bumps and getting crabs. Dude would be in agony. This man should be in jail at the very least and ejected into outer space at the very most. A Logos reference? Next tweet. So someone posted a picture of the chick from Fantastic Four with the caption, Hear me out. Dude quote retweets this saying, N-words would have to shake the fabric of time and space to remove my tongue from her asshole. Well folks, we just managed to get the Wendy's 2 for 5 deal on this one. Not only did you catch someone simping for the worst girl in the MCU, but you also got another one with a crippling case of horny. If it were someone like Black Widow, I'd understand, since she probably gives great CBT. For the character from the most forgettable series in the MCU, you have to be down fucking atrocious. Because not only do I not remember her name, I also don't remember anyone else's name except for the thing. So these males need to be locked up in a re-education camp, but instead of political propaganda, we force them to look at better opinions. You can do better, King. Now we have this stud, this fucking lad, this fella, if you will, tweeting out, Ass shape is better than ass size. Now, hey Seuss, why didn't you censor this young man? You may be asking yourself. Because this fine fella here is speaking the truth. You won't catch me simping for anyone with a fat ass without a pleasing shape to look at. See, this fella is a prime example of what it means to have good taste. Unlike the hooligans from the last post. Now, this is strictly speaking in terms of ass. If you were doing a tier list, it'd go from best to worst as follows. Elf ears, thighs, tits, ass, and arco nasbles, and feet. You could put a rotting raccoon corpse on my dinner plate, puke on it, and then force feed it to me and it'd still be a better experience than being a foot fetishist. Thank you for showing my audience what peak taste looks like, Josh. Next tweet. Fellas, if ya girl buy, how y'all feel about her getting a little pussy every now and then? That's cheating to y'all or it don't matter? Be honest. <sighs> Someone replies with, only if she okay with me getting some dick. Hundred hundred. OP... OP replies with just a simple question mark, and that question mark says it all. Okay, bro, this is some James Charles type beat behavior. The only way I'd be accepting a partner having sex with other people is if they're no longer my partner. Because at that point, they aren't my goddamn problem anymore. What do you mean a rental boy wife doesn't count? Anyways, how are you gonna be ballsy enough to say that and then not even answer the question? Because, bro... That is about as clear of an answer as the North Koreans with cataracts. Now don't get me wrong, I support gay relationships as long as they aren't mixed race, but this shit isn't it. A mixed race couple made me, therefore all mixed race couples are bad. That's how logic works. Which is why I got this video sponsored by Based Robin. They have the brand new racial slurpee so you can harass all minorities and majorities alike. Only at Based Robins. Call 341-890. Anyways, thank you guys for watching this video. Comment, like, and subscribe. Turn on post notifications to this channel and my second channel. Go follow my Instagram. Go follow my Twitter. Go join my Discord and subreddit while you're at it. And uh, yeah, how do you space cowboy? I have N hentai bookmarked.